Ba, 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 ba. Hey there, everyone! This is Al Cow playing Super Mario Galaxy. It's uh, the game where Super Mario Galaxies? <laughs> How would galaxying work as a verb? More mail! What up, mail guy? What do you want? You have a letter from Luigi! How'd you get there? Luigi, you absolute buffoon. How? No, really though. How did you get in that cage? Uh, where is that place? Looks familiar, but then again, that's the, um, Battle Rock, right? Battle Rock was in which world? Uh, I think that was the fount. Wait, is there more letters? Uh, like, you're still dinging. Like, does that mean something? Oh, okay, Princess Peach. She's like, whoa, check it out, it's me! Yeah, that's her catchphrase. <laughs> that's why she's so popular, I'll take it. Game I've been getting a little bit... Yeah, I thought it was like, ah, but you know, ah. No, you said that literally last time. Are you done honking? Thank you. I think Battle Rock is in Fountain. Check out, it's me, the Fountain Man. Uh... Yeah, Battle Rock right there. There's a green question mark even, making it very subtle. All right, Luigi. Let's get you out of that cage. It looks like, so it's that early place in that one level where you need to lead uh, bullet bills towards, um, towards a cage to like uncork a, a fly spin, a luma. Except that one is like underneath the thing. It's like underneath that, yeah. So, you know, you have to, like, carry the bullet bill underneath with you. Looks like you're making me play the whole level until we get to that phase, unless he's underneath one of these, but I don't think he will, no. Alright, um... So, first instance of making me replay a, a whole level. Like, last time I had to free Luigi from the... From uh, the roof, like it was like right at the start. Here it's a little bit further. Um, all right. Whoa! Give me your tornado power. Whoa! All right, that was that was the computer doing that. Hey, buddy! Come on! All right, all right, all right. What am I doing? Right. Yeah, uh, I've been wondering, like, is it, should I just, like, edit out completely the replay? Because, like, I don't know. No, we're almost there. And this gives us a chance to, like, catch up. Hey, hi. Hey there, everyone. Like, how is it going? Did you make a big, weird donut of coin appear in a way that doesn't seem worth getting? Yeah, me too. <laughs> so there's a range to this, but it's, yeah, it's pretty far. It's a pretty good range. I don't know. I was not looking for looms like that. There we go. We now switched around. We got orbs on the sides. Pretty spooky. Got a spin. Whoa. Okay, no. I just, like, got a few of these that are on the side. Man, temporarily, I have already destroyed this infrastructure. I can't believe that Luigi was uh, someone involved with constructing this whole base again just so we could have some a little bit of attention what a guy can you just flop these orb these cannonballs i don't know like it feels like a dangerous thing to just kind of try to attack i mean at worst i lose like one hell though like like, the reality is, you know, when you get punished in this game... Well, that's not true. If you lose a race, Mario just dies. I could see how Luigi would be kind of an upset kind of guy. Like, he lives in a pretty tragic family. Imagine if your older brother, if he ever gets a little bit disappointed, just ups and dies. Like, how would that affect your psyche? All right, so if I read the, the screenshot correctly, I cannot kill the underived guy. He should be like, he's right here. What are you doing there, you idiot? All right, well, that was me screaming at him. All right, so yeah, so this is basically redoing the level, except this time you go downstairs somehow. All right, how are we making that work? So I, what, Bill? Okay, got your attention. 
It's me, I am the bullet bill guy. Well, that's you. All right, can I get you? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, shoot, I lost control of where I am. But Bullet Bill is still here. He's not here anymore. Woo! Oh, but he was there though. Okay, I thought it was further back. All right, my mistake. All right, buddy. Oh, not these cages though. All right. See, this is where I find that things might get tough. Yeah, help him! Yay! I blew up Luigi, but he was okay. Wow, that's Luigi's catchphrase. <laughs> wow. Yes, I do. Um, I promise nothing. Also, where were you hiding that thing? Why is it green? What did you do to it to make it green, Luigi? See, this is why. No, the power star is Mario. That's what he was going to say, but I interrupted him while, while getting it. You know, that's just wacky video game limitations. The wackiest. Uh, sorry it's all green. Rosalina. Oh, Luigi under the saucer. I mean, she wouldn't know, I guess, by the name. I don't know. Maybe the names of stars are retroactive. Like, why would you call it like that? That wouldn't make any sense. I did. Uh, they have a sp what they do. Uh. Okay. I guess I will after saving the game, if you so insist. But be aware that you know it's only because you're asking. Yeah. So I did see that. Well, I interpret it as glass. As a glass launch star, I guess it's supposed to be green. Thank you for helping me. I am a guardian of the trial galaxies. So in two Luigi's, I will unlock the trial galaxy. All right, if you say so. All right, now back in the kitchen. So I think it's just a Bowser head and like a question block. And, you know, I feel like I cannot get here until I've cleared everything else, so... A new galaxy has appeared! It's a bull. Buo Base. Ooh, I remember the name. Because I think I named, <laughs> I named the ATS episode after the name of this level. Because of the galaxy soundtrack. Alright, well here we are. The Floating Fortress. Yeah, it's on water. It's not, like, normally when you hear Floating Fortress, like you think it's floating in the air. It might be floating in the air? It's in the water. That is a fortress with like a cool like orb over it. This is a really cool song. Oh, it's this song. Oh, yeah, okay. There's a Gearbot head. Hello, Mr. Gearbot head. This here is a floating fortress. We call it Blue Base. All right. Fair enough. And there's a friendly uh, penguin right there. Oh, and there's another one hopping. What would happen if he blew up the underwater weight? Uh,. It, would it float? That tower in the middle of the water would float right up to the surface. Is that what I want to do? All right, well, you got my attention. Let's make it happen now. Maybe. Because, let's see, we got... Oh, we got a blooper. We got me being stuck against the wall a little bit. So you got these air... Th like, you got... Yeah, you got these glass orbs. They're just kind of chilling. Oh, and we got Torpedo Ted. Who's kind of illin'? Uh, Alright, hey, Torpedo Ted, can you break this for me? Like, I just literally did that for Luigi. Come on, break the thing, thank you. Alright, yeah, and that makes a whirlpool, which will lead me to a world of adventure. On top. <laughs> that looks green too, doesn't it? So is it not always Luigi? Alright, well that's how you get on top. I don't know if I'm here too early. Or what? Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, you don't... Oops. They don't, uh, get that unlocked. They don't pop open the question thing. Alright, fine. That's what I want to see. I want to see what was inside it. Uh, yeah, so I get the feeling that while I found my way to the very topmost portion of the world, yeah, I don't think there's gonna be a whole lot I'm gonna be able to do here. Seems like something I might have unlocked. Whoa, this is water? Okay, then. Wait, am I? I'm, I'm underneath. I was underneath. Oh, all right. Um, so you. 
speed of 10. I don't- Whoa! Okay, so that did not have the effect I thought it would. Uh, okay. I need to go back for air because I need to figure out what I want. Like, I want to rise this up, right? So, and there are torpedo Ted launchers, and there are bubbles, so I feel like I need to... Yeah, so, these bubble canisters, like this, for example, right there, on the right side of the screen. So I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna, hey, hey, Torpedo Ted, when is Torpedo Ted coming out to play? Huh? You're not? Because, uh... Oh, now you, I think you just reloaded. Like, I just heard a sound like that. Okay, I don't know where I am. Okay, someone's after me, but like, I'm not ready for it. Oh my god. Uh, no, where? Swim more better. Swim to the side. Why can I not turn? Okay, I just think I'm Just get out of there. Get out of there. Okay. Okay. Just, why am I, whoa. I'm moving forward now. I, like, lost control, it feels like, for a hot second. Oh, wait a second. So you do that. Then you hold jump to... Okay, I don't know. Maybe it was like a camera thing? I just felt like I did not have the control I wanted. Alright, so I need to, one, get the attention of a Ted, and two, get a to... One of the bubble thing. All right, I got your attention. Do I get? Okay, I got your attention. Cool bananas. Now I need to like. Okay, explode this, please. Explode this, please. Are you? Yeah, you did it. All right, and that rises it up a little bit. Is that the only such thing that we could see there? Uh, maybe that's all we really wanted? I'm not sure. Alright. Yeah, see, last time I feel like when I was swimming, I felt things controlled pretty well. I am not feeling the same level of control here this time, and I'm not sure why. Oh, we got these, like, the last that uh, was up. That's adorable. Alright. Here we go. So, I just enabled the ability to get these. Truly a worthwhile work in penmanship. Oh, but it looks like where we really want to go is over here. All right. We got a little, like, Flub Master. Here's Fat Thwomp. Just like, oh, this is hard. Oh, gotta go back in. It's working hard, though. Good for you. Well, shoot. No, no, no. Uh, hey, I cheated. Okay. Uh, no, okay. So, wall jumps. A lot easier than they are in Sonic Unleash. Except, I find it so hard to just stay in between walls. It's really hard to describe. I feel like I went into it a little bit during that time where I was wall jumping between waterfalls. As one does. Okay, I'm somewhere. Alright, we got these little guys. Get out of here, buddy. You're like a Goomba, except you have like an attack attempt. So, kind of like Mario 64 Goombas. Alright, swamps and swamps and swamping. So I know the water bobble, this is gonna like push me away. Okay, so it's just gonna, uh, alright, you know what, you go ahead and yeah, you do that. Hey, Gearbot, how you doing? Bidip bidip, uh, who left those water shooters on? Uh, I wanted to do that before you even said anything. So that's just, oh, what? Why did you not, like, so if you do that, then you're like, whoosh, but for some reason, you're just not doing it. Okay, well, oh, maybe it's this wall over here that you want me to interact with. I can do that. Here we go! So I just made a little tornado bob up here. Dead. Okay, do I want you here? Like, that's why they put a circle here? Yeah, that's right! Whoa, oh, whoa! Sorry, sorry, Bob, sorry. Whoa, okay, you know what? Everyone's down to bouncing here. It's fine. It happens. Uh, what we call midday. I don't. Okay, so now these things be twirling, and also we got little things to find. God, it I understand. I got a hit. Walking really high. Hey, it's um, our favorite enemy from Mario 64. All right, so looms I will get. So to address, I forget if I addressed this in video yet, but every time I fight a boss, I get people that are like, "Wow, cow." 
Why are you not buying the bigger health mushroom? If you were to buy that, then you would be okay. Here's my, here's my answer, because it's not just me being weird. Or at the very least, I have an answer. Maybe the answer is weird. That's, that's for you to decide. But, um... That's uh, good, number two. Uh, yeah, I haven't seen any other. I hope they're all around. So, here's the thing. I know that I need uh, Lums on the map to unlock galaxies. Like, that is something that has been presented to me for a while now. It is a fact of the game. And, you know, like, and I, and I acknowledge that. Like, that's just a thing. And I don't know how much I'm gonna end up needing. Like, I just do not know. All right, I can see a blue down there on top of the swamp. So, it is an unknown sort of uh, variable that I'm dealing with. However, what I do know is that if I try enough... Oh, now we need to go back all the way there, I guess. Okay, so the pipe I unlock, is it still underwater? I think it will be still underwater. But, so yeah, so like, if I give a boss enough tries, I know that eventually I'm gonna win. That I am absolutely certain of. So what I'm doing is that I'm, I'm basically leaning my decision-making abilities towards things that I'm certain of, Versus things that I am not. No, wait a second. I can look here, but I can't look around, which is a decision. All right, doesn't like. So did I misinterpret? I might have misinterpreted. And also the pipe is gone. Uh, all right, never mind. Uh, but yeah, so it is. All of this to say, it is a decision that I let myself. Yeah. Uh, gamble on just getting the boss done and saving up on lums for the future because while I'm sure to get farming for lum I'm sure not a that big of a deal uh, I'd still rather not so there you go there's a star launcher over there I saw oh so yeah now these are all turned off so like that kind of makes us there's a star launcher there which I think was probably meant so that if you fall, you get like a, a shortcut back. Ah, so you cannot stomp a uh, tornado, man. Good to know. Alright, no, yeah, I'm t doing this the long way. It's fine. That is absolutely okay. Oh, calm down, buddy. You got a spring on your step. And now I'm up here. Unbelievable. Like, the platforming here is a lot of fun. And I am glad to do more of it. So, you know, it's all good. Yeah, the Goomba's money. All right, so I need to go here, and we're gonna go up there, and from there we're gonna go ever high. Like it makes sense that you would go ever higher. It's, I don't know the the cutscene for the thing looked like a. I wasn't sure what it was showing, and I just kind of acted on an impulse, and that's okay. It's okay to be impulsive at the right times. All right, buddy. I, so yeah, see, I think the idea is you'd get them all on the way up. So that when you get the last one, that's like all on the top. Yeah, like you get your thing. Okay, uh, here we go. Yeah, yeah, that is exactly what happened. Wrong button, there you go. No, not even. This true thing that throws lasers, can I not do anything to it? Maybe I just did the wrong thing. It's possible. All right, so little islands of safety against the evil, well, evil, I don't know. That's clearly a screw, so yeah, that's what you need to do, okay. Oh, jeez, what? Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. Just like the way it opens up. Oh, all right. Uh, all right, get down. I'm still not sure. Yeah, I'm, I guess it was showing me the when I got the blue, the things that appeared, like the, the pole stars. That has to be it, right? You know what? It's fine. Sometimes I do things and we run around in circles. It happens. So I should get a galaxy clear? Yeah. I mean, if I don't get the galaxy clear, then it's all the little, like, star things. And I think our shortcuts are not shortcuts and they do something. But I think it's gonna be a clear. I'm gonna save. 
Does it tell you the galaxy clear after you saved? So we're not necessarily done. See, normally these box are one and done, but maybe not. Okay, I just I just need to verify myself. Luigi, if I do this, like I'm not gonna do this, I want to see. It's green. Like I'm trying to understand, but like Luigi isn't lost yet. It seems to be saying that Luigi's already- uh, or are the question marks always green and I never noticed? Or maybe Luigi just got lost and I just didn't pick the mail yet. That's also possible. But okay, okay. So box galaxies not necessarily one and done. Good to know. <laughs>